how to add products to Shopify from AutoDS. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how simple and easy it is to add products from your dropshipping supplier or solution, which is going to be AutoDS to your Shopify store. So the process is going to be very easy and simple. We are going to head over to Shopify.com, sign in for an account, and then we are going to see the admin dashboard. What are we going to do is going to be very simple. We're going to type in on the search bar auto DS like this, and we're going to find the app. So we are going to click on the app and install it. In my case, I have already installed the app and everything is logged in. Everything is synchronized and everything is okay. So what are we going to do here is basically you can see the app market or the marketplace of the auto DS in here. So, you can either head over the AutoDS platform by clicking on the button here, or you can go ahead and open up into your navigator. And also you can go ahead and have the same menu, same everything right there. And you can import products from here directly. So let's proceed to AutoDS from here. Now let's say that we are going to add a product, one of the products, and let's say that we are going to choose a winning product, which is maybe this one. So we are going to choose the product and we are going to have the product like this. Click on import draft and we're going to follow here by clicking on click here to track the progress. And we are going to find the product into your products or your drafts. So here we have drafts and we're going to see that it has, as you can see here, the, um, let's say the drafts that you're going to import. So I'm going to choose the product that I have clicked or selected, click on import. So it is going to start to import. Whenever it is going to be finished, you're going to see receive a notification like this. You're going to click on to view or click to view and you're going to find your product here. So I'm going to close up these notifications. So here we have the product. You can go ahead and modify the product or add an internal notes in here. So you can go ahead and click on edit and start editing your product as much as you want. So basically this is the product. You can modify the variance by clicking on edit, modify the price, the profits, the fees, and also the profits like this. For example, I'm going to have the profits or the price as like this. We're going to have the general, as you can see, uh, description of the product, the style, the quantity, and etc. Click on save and you're going to see everything set up in one place. Now we have set everything. We have everything set up. And what can we do now is going to be very simple. This product is normally added to our Shopify store. We are going to make sure that it has been added. So we are going to back to the Shopify store, click on products and wait for it. Normally, this is the product. It is going to be named TikTok Shop Retractable Car Charger. So this is it. Now we are going to find the product and here it is. Now you can see that we have modified the, uh, the product as you can see price and we have it again or the new price is available. So we're going to see that everything is in place. We can view the product, start selling it by adding different payment methods into our Shopify store and it is going to be here. So this is the theme and also you're going to see the product is going to be here available. That was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one.